So my name is Michael Krutina. I'm the Chief Sales Officer of Milrin Robotics. Here we have our uh, Temis Combat um, in a configuration that can be also used for counter UAS. So we have a radar a Spexer for, uh, to detect the drone up to 6, 10 kilometers, depending on the size. And we have a remote weapon station from Bahash, a Saudi company um, that is capable of taking down those drones with a, a machine gun, 12.7 millimeter caliber and a, a grenade launcher 30 millimeter um, to, with, with different kind of ammunition to take down the drone. So we have two different um, weapons here to engage different targets. Um, so you could imagine um, ground targets are better uh, uh, engaged with a machine gun or with high explosive. Uh, drones are better engaged with um, with pro proximity views rounds that can be fired from the grenade launcher. So we can uh, we can simultaneously engage two different uh, uh, sets of targets at the same time uh, by the use of uh, the electro optical sensor, uh, thermal, night vision, day vision, and all of that is of course remotely controlled. Um, so the, the vehicle itself can operate for about 12 hours. Uh, the, if it's not in autonomous mode, uh, the operator should be in a range for one to two kilometers away from the vehicle, depending on the radio and the antennas. Uh, the vehicle in this configuration has not been sold. The vehicle uh, in different configurations had been sold to 16 countries meantime. Good. So, I mean, the, the, the collaboration with Edge is, um, we, we have been uh, working with Edge quite some time and uh, Edge decided that we fill a, a, or we provide a technology that they currently do not have. And that is why they acquired a majority share. That is also why we are here at the, uh, at the Edge booth. Um, coming back to the vehicle, uh, it's a serial hybrid. That means it's an electrically driven vehicle with a battery pack. Uh, but as we all know, battery and, and electricity is something that you do not have on the, on the battlefield. You need to provide energy from a different source. And diesel, fuel is the energy source in the military all over the world. That is why we, we chose a diesel generator to provide the energy and to charge the batteries to have uh, the vehicle go up to 15 hours in general and up to two hours, one and a half hour in silent mode without the engine running. It can go, it can uh, wade through water up to 60 centimeters. Hello everyone. This is Taha Rifai. I'm the Defense Business Unit Manager at Wahaj. Wahaj is a Saudi company based in Riyadh, which is we are uh, we are specialized in machining and some system of the defense. I will talk you through. I will talk through this system, which is called Remote Control Weapon Station, which is have do, dual uh, machine guns and can be used for a line system. Uh, basically, this system is to, uh, mainly about the optic system here, which is we have three different camera, which is day, night, and thermal. And it can be controlled by the system by control panel, which is away far from this one, which is we can use the joystick to set the, the system either automatic or semi-automatic and can be tracked by itself and also there's one more advantage here which is can be tracking the target and it can be also holded two different weapons which is 50 caliber 12.7 and this one which is MK19 uh, 40 caliber
وتستفيد من تسعين في الماء من قطع الطيران التجارية الجاهزة لما في ذلك مكونات سباقات شفرولية بيرفورمانس لطرق الوعرة إن آي إس بي ذات البنية المفتوحة هي مركبة تكتيكية استكشافية خفيفة للغاية مع إمكانية النقل عبر إسقاط جوي منخفض السرعة. آي إس including Chevrolet performance off-road racing components and open agriculture ISV is an extraordinary ultra-light triple vehicle with low variety airdrop transparency. The ISV family of vehicles is going to work to meet diverse mission profiles. Condor SUV is trained to arm and 
يمكن تسويقها الا هي بمحرك ديزل سعه 3.3 لتر او محرك بنزين سعه 3.5 لتر وناقل الحركه اوتوماتيكي كما انها مزوده بنظام الحمايه البالستيه من المستوى الاول وتتسع بنقل ثمانيه ركاب بمعدادهم لتنفيذ المهام والسير على تضاريس مختلفه.
الحسن في أوزبكستان يمكن تدريب هذه المركبة لتصل إلى مستوى B6 من الحماية وتعتمد هذه المركبة على هيكل ديك أب بيوتا لابتروزا 79 بمحرك ديزل 8 اسطوانات ونقل حركة يدوي ونظام تعليق مطور Which 
هذه السيارة هي خيار ممتاز لمختلف السيناريوهات بما في ذلك مكافحة الشر ومكافحة الحرارة ومهما يحب السلام.